Hi, I'm Richie Hackett and I'm here at the Crops Open Day in Chagaskin Oak Park and I'm here in a field of, of winter rye. I suppose winter rye is a relatively new crop uh, in Ireland and the initial ex work that we did on rye it was very positive, we got very high yields of, of the crop uh, but we were basing our management of the crop on agronomy recommendations from abroad so we decided that we needed to update those uh, guidelines for Irish conditions. Uh, rye has a good number of positives in, in terms of it, it, its growth, uh, it's got good disease uh, uh, resistance, good tolerance of take all and BYDV which makes it suitable for so early sowing, uh, it's good uh, package in terms of foliar disease uh, uh, re resistance as well. It, it's also very good in terms of nitrogen use efficiency. Uh, so we've compared its nitrogen use efficiency with that of, of winter wheat and we found it, uh, that it needs a lot less nitrogen than winter wheat. And that has a, a secondary benefit as well as uh, making the crop cheaper to grow. It has a secondary benefit in terms of reducing the carbon footprint of, of the crop. Uh, we've also looked at, at growth regulator strategies. It's obviously a very tall crop as you can see. And we've looked at uh, minimizing the, the risk of lodging through optimizing our, our, our growth regulator uh, input. In, in terms of uses for the crop, uh, it's, it's mainly used for animal feed, particularly useful for uh, pig feed, uh, but it can also be used in, in uh, the drinks industry for making uh, whiskey and also for uh, in human consumption of uh, making uh, bread. Um, so it has a number of markets, but the markets are quite limited at, at the moment and the next step in the work will be to uh, increase the market for the, for the crop so that it can be grown a, on a wider scale. But it is a positive crop, it's a high yielding crop and, and we see some future for the crop.